I bought my little spark car in 2020, right before the pandemic. And for those of you that follow me know how much I love my little spark car. I named it Little Sparky. My little spark car almost has 25,000 miles on it. And no, this video is not the 25,000 mile review. But it almost has 25,000 miles on it. But there were a few things that is a problem with Little Sparky. The first thing, Little Sparky is black. As you can see. And Little Sparky is a small car, as you can see. With that being said, I'm giving Little Sparky an upgrade. Guys, I will tell you more about the upgrade after a little bit, after it gets done. But remember, the reason I'm doing this is because the car is black and it's small. And Walking up a road has no sidewalks. Let me show you. Watch over. Car coming. Car coming. As you can tell, there's no sidewalks. And when a truck comes, you got to get way over. <laughs> we was going to walk in the grass, but anyway, we're headed up to a place that's up the road called an apple orchard. We got an hour to kill. And at the end of the video, sorry for making you all wait, but you probably guessed it. If I show anything they're doing inside, you're going to guess right away what they're doing. So... I'm going to debate if I'm going to tell you now or not. Was that Orcut? I thought that was Orcut. By the way, Orcut's my old boss. He's up, he lives up this route. Okay, guys, we're going to wait till we get the apple orchard. This may not have been a good idea. Very dangerous walking up this route. But anyway, I might tell you anyway what we're doing. Matter of fact, let me think on it. Wasn't able to get much video in there, but you can see the big apple. You can see it from be behind me. Yeah. Wasn't able to get much video. It's a little early. And, uh, I don't want to say anybody's cranky, but it just didn't feel right. You know what I mean, guys? All right. I decided I'm going to tell you what we're doing. We're yeah. getting our car tenant. Okay. We'll do the next vlog entry when we get down because this is very dangerous going back. They definitely... Can't go about to see us. Oh my god, this is so dangerous. I can see these people now saying, look at these idiots walking in the road. And there's one videotaping himself as he does it. As he does it. How you like that kind of language? And one videotaping himself as he does it. Look at these idiots. Uh, I don't know, I might say that. No, I would never say that. I have said that before. Now I'm the idiot doing it. Kind of cool, huh? But yeah, we're up here and I'll show you the name of the place. Uh, it's a little bit of drive from home. But they have the best results. They have the best, uh, we checked into them, uh, reviews. And we are getting our windows tenant. And the reason we're getting our windows tenant is because our car is black and it's hot. Oh my God, is it ever. And plus at night when I drive it, Car I'm getting cover. blinded. I see that, babe. Okay. I'm getting blinded by other headlights at night. It hurts my eyes. All right, guys, I'll video more in a little bit. This is where we're at. All right, let's go on down there and maybe get some shots of the car getting done. Yeah, when we got here, we wasn't sure what tent to go. I think we're going what grade? Oh, sorry. Uh, 15. And then the front wheel and windshield's gonna be a little different. I don't know, no, actually, I think it's 15 all the way around. I think, don't quote me on that. I will tell you exactly what it is when the car gets done. Oh, these German Shepherds are going nuts. It's okay, puppy, it's okay. It's okay, I do believe there is a, uh, one of them fences there. Yep, there is. It can't go beyond that. But he had a little thing inside there where it had a light that was putting out heat. And he showed the different grades and we put our hand underneath it and the one we're getting <laughs> lets in very little heat. But guys, uh, yeah, I'm excited. The main reason I'm doing this is because the heat of the car and at nighttime the lights blind me from other drivers. Especially when these big SUVs and trucks, especially the size behind me, gets behind me. I had a red light or you're driving down the road, sometimes it blinds me to the point that I see nothing but flashes in my eyes. 
Okay, before we go inside, my anxiety is a little high. Yeah. For those of you who follow me, know how I am on my anxiety. I gotta calm down a little before I go inside, but we came to the back of the property and wow, this is kind of pretty. A little opening right here. I said we walk up a little bit further. But look at this. It opens up into a beautiful little field. Oh my Lord. Oh, now this helps my anxiety right here, y'all. It does. House back there? Yeah. I just thought of something. You see how my glasses tint up out here? Uh -huh. Now my glasses, when they tint, they're not like sunglasses. Okay. I could tell a little bit, but sunglasses is a lot darker, but yet to look at them, you'd think it'd be super dark, but it's not. Mm -hmm. And that's probably how the windows are going to be. Because exactly. that was our concern. Are we able, going to be able to see out of them? My truck was tenant. And I don't know what the hell they used on that. I couldn't see that well at night. But he was show, he, we asked the guy. He says he has no problem seeing at night. And it really helps out with the headlights, the glare. All right. Want to head inside and watch him work a little sparky? Yeah. There you is. Hi, you. <laughs> I may not do any talking here while they're working on a car. I might add a little bit of music to it, so we'll see what happens, guys, okay? I feel weird talking when you're real close to somebody working on your car. Okay, the car is done. Now, before I show it to you, we can't roll the windows down for about two to three days. And it's going to bubble up like crazy for the next two weeks until the water that they put on evaporates. But guys, here's my little sparky. Not bad, really. Dirty. The windows got dirty. The car's dirty. <laughs> but not bad at all. Not bad at all. Let's do a full walk around. Not bad. Not bad at all. I've been kicking around in my head for the longest time. I'm going to get the windows tinted or not. Ever since we got her. The thing is, she's black. The car is solid black. Black cars hold more heat. I knew this when we bought it. That was one of the things we talked about. And this summer has been the hottest summer I've seen in many, many years. And getting into this car from my driveway or any other place we went, it was like getting inside a oven. And we would have to roll the windows down just to get the air going in there. And it, it just didn't do any good for at least a good 15 minutes, if not 20. And then not to mention when I'm at on the roads at nighttime, other headlights blaring kind of get... It bothers my eyes, especially the bigger vehicles getting up behind me and that light's just coming right in and it's just blinding the crap out of me. It ain't their fault. It's because I drive a small car. So this will prevent that as well. There's a bee. Do you see that little sweat bee? I don't know if I'm going to mention the price that I paid to get the windows tinted. I probably won't. Let's just say it's a lot cheaper than we thought it would. It took them exactly one hour. Lifetime guarantee on the windows. And if anything ever happens, he says, give them a call. But we can't roll the windows down for two to three days. And it's going to bubble up like crazy for the next two weeks. He says, other than that, it's got a lifetime warranty. And yeah. All right, guys. Little Sparky got an upgrade. Leave me comments down there. Now, my truck had tenant windows, and I did miss that part. So now a little Sparky has them. I'll let you know in the next couple days how I feel about it. I will. Right now, now, I tell you, you know what's bothering me right now? They put it on, and I see the streaks in the windows where they wiped it down with their, uh, I don't know, with their uh, cloths, and I see the dirt marks on the windows. Don't do that with your fingers, huh? Because your fingers contain oil and... I, I wasn't, I was. But let me see if you can see it. Look it out. This right here is just basically dirt, you know? And that bothers me because, to be honest with you, I, I, I noticed things. And where they were spraying it on the windows, you can see where it dripped down. And that bothers me. 
Yes, I'm a clean freak. But little Sparky got an upgrade, tenant windows, and she's looking mighty fine. Mighty fine, guys. All right, until next time. And there's, can you see that little sweat bee? Look at this little sweat bee. He's on my finger, look at that. The little sweat bee right there is on my baby, on my finger, look at that. <laughs> yeah, I'll let him stay there for a little bit. Until next time, guys, come on, let's get out of here.